Wow, look how the battery is changing back to red. JoJo Science Show! Hello, welcome to JoJo Science Show. Today we're going to make a color changing mug. <laughs> uh, I tried to say mug. A color changing mug <gasps> changes color when you add a hot liquid and it changes back when you add a cold liquid. I'm going to teach you a big word. Thermochromic. Let's break down that big word and see what it means. <laughs> Thermochromic is made up of two smaller words. Thermo, which means temperature, and chromic, which means color. So thermochromic material changes color with temperature. For this experiment, you'll need a mug, you'll need clear nail polish, a marker, you'll need a bowl, you'll need some thermochromic pigment. <laughs> I got this thermochromic pigment from eBay. Kids, make sure an adult is supervising you doing this experiment. This thermochromic dye changes from red to clear at 31 degrees Celsius or 88 degrees Fahrenheit. First, draw something on your mug with a marker. I drew a battery. This drawing will be visible at high temperature. Pour a little bit of nail polish in the bowl. Next, mix a little bit of pigment with it. Stir, 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 stir. See how we worked out all the lumps and now it's one color? Now use your pigmented polish to paint the mug. Now that it's all painted, we have to wait for it to dry. Nail polish smells really strong, so don't inhale the fumes while it's drying. You can also do this experiment with school glue instead of nail polish. If you want to make this more permanent, you can use a two-part epoxy instead of the nail polish, but you would need an adult to do that. Now that the first coat is dry, we can put a second clear coat on it to protect it. So here's the second clear coat. Now the top coat is dry. I have some warm water here and let's see what happens when we pour it into the green cup. Wow, look how it's really changing color. Wow. See the battery turned green? Now I'm gonna empty the hot water and put in the cold water. Wow, look how the battery is changing back to red. It looks like it needs to charge again. Isn't that awesome? That's really red. So, how does this work? The big dots are the atoms that make up the pigment. The smiley faces are electrons. When atoms share electrons, it makes a bond between them. A thermochromic dye works because heat excites the electrons in one of the chemical bonds, causing it to break. When it breaks, the new molecule has a different color. When it cools back down, the bond forms again, and the color changes back. You just learned how to make your own color-changing paint. Now you can make so many different color changing things. Thanks for watching JoJo Science Show. If you like this video, then hit the thumbs up button down below and subscribe to my channel so that you can see all my fun videos. And remember kids, science is fun!